Did you know you can downgrade Windows XP back to your old operating system? Hi everyone, what is up? It is me, the Yellow Penguin. And today we're going to be talking about how you could downgrade Windows XP back to your old operating system back then. Now, if you know in Windows 10 or 11, you can go ahead, go to settings, advanced options, and restore to your old version within 10 days of Windows. That's kind of cool, you know, letting you, if you have issues, bugs, whatever, you can downgrade back to your old operating system. Like Windows 10, upgrade from 7 to 10, 8 to 10, 10 to 11, 10 RTM to 10, 21H1, I don't know. You could downgrade it within 10 days. On Windows XP, you could uninstall by downgrading back to Windows 98 or Windows ME. So in this video, we're, I'm going to be showing an example of downgrading back to Windows. Now, as a precaution, I'm not sure if this is 10 days, if there's a limit. I'm showing you what I know, really as an example. You cannot, however, downgrade from Windows 2000. It's Windows 98 or ME. So basically the 9X system. Now I hope you enjoy the video, and let's get on to the video. Okay, so as you can see right here, here we are on an upgraded version of Windows XP from Windows Millennium Edition. As you can see, we just got an upgrade, it's made with a wallpaper. For some reason, Pinball turns into Movie Maker. Kind of interesting, but whatever. We have Outlook on the desktop, we have all of this application on the desktop. So here is how you would undo your upgrade from Windows 98 or Windows Millennium Edition. We need to go to Control Panel, Add or Remove Programs, and go to Windows XP Uninstall. We click Change or Remove, and then we click Uninstall Windows XP. As in series here, it says, Are you sure you want to uninstall Windows XP and restore your user system? We're going to click Yes. Now it's processing, so let's think about your Windows XP installation because now that we're shutting down, next time you boot up, it's going to be uninstalling. It's kind of like in Windows 10, when you have your, or 11, when you, or 8, I don't know, whatever, whatever, so you have, I think, as you see, starting with this uninstallation, but in those operating systems, it shows your little, oh, look at that, you have, like, that custom Windows screen where it has, like, gray, you know, Windows uninstalling, and you're going to laugh. So, it's not like Windows 10 where you're, like, you do an upgrade, and you're going to, it's kind of like that. It's basically the exact same thing. And now we are booting back into Windows Millennium Edition. Back to what we had before. We don't think it's this exact thing, but whatever. And now we are- oh, this can go all the way to That's cool, I guess. Um, so as you can see right here, as you know, we have all these one engines, so, so. And so that is it. I'm sorry for the bad audio, but as you just saw, we have successfully uninstalled and downgraded Windows XP. So I really hope you guys enjoyed the video like and subscribe for next week's video um we post new videos every single wednesday at 3 p.m pacific standard time zone so yeah thank you guys so much for watching see you guys in the next video bye